So many people in America are facing the pandemic and the epidemic that we're facing because of illness. Illness has taken many forms across our land for many, many years. We, of course, have the illness of cancer, which is one way of God calling us home. And in my family, I've had several people face and beat cancer several times. My own late mother faced cancer four times. I have a sibling who faced cancer, I believe, two times. I know I had another sibling that sort of had a scare with it, and hopefully she was able to get rid of, I think, a polyp for it. In life, we're talking about the truth of illness, and the truth of illness can, of course, be of the physical body, but right now we're facing an epidemic. Now, did everyone get to see Tom Cruise's movie on this? It was happening a long time ago. Or Will Smith's movie, where things became really crazy in terms of what they look like, but it was still sort of an illness. So we've sort of had the precursor from Hollywood that often gets its information secretly and privately from the federal government that this is a possibility. We also know that there are terrorist groups across America who really hate us and they get here sadly in crazy ways. Yesterday I saw a young man in the store that I typically shopped at almost every day, several times a day, because that's how I feed myself, and I'm allowed to do that. I'm allowed to decide where my discretionary income is going to be spent. Who I spoke with on campus, it took me till today sort of to remember him and how I met him, but he speaks a pretty modest version of Japanese, and he's Chinese. But he was there with his parents. He also speaks incredibly good English, but I was sort of surprised by this, because he had told me that his parents were still back in China. Now, in life, we have moments of time to speak the truth about illness. An illness can affect anyone at any time. There's all kinds of illnesses that we know from not only the hospitals in our communities and our children's resource centers in the municipalities of life that everyone can be impacted by illness. It might be not directly upon us or directly upon our family members or extended family members, but it could be on our friends and our what we call family of choice members. These are people that we chose to be betrothed to. These are people that we chose to spend our time with. These are the people that really mean something to the impact of our spiritual life, our educational life, our emotional life, our psychological life, our intellectual life.